we are back on our architectural team as an administrator and we want to create our package because we received this uh, notification from the furniture team that we they, they need they need uh, this content so they can bring context to to their models uh, so now we're gonna create a new package so remember we are under under the design collaboration module and we're gonna create a new package and the model the model shows up here on the screen the viewer and we can we can change the name of the team but of 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 this package that you are we are creating right now but before we do that let's cancel this and and you see a new button here which is update your team space with the latest content so if we click here it says there are no new sets to update from from your team so this is the new publish button you still have the publish button on on Revit doing the, the collaboration with the publish process in Revit but but you can also pull the data from Revit from the cloud and, and bring it here and do the update here remember that on, on BIM360 team we didn't have that option before so now it is here because uh, there is also a way to do it through Forge. There is a command which allows you to publish, to publish uh, the latest and greatest uh, models. So since there is nothing to update, we, we're going to go ahead back to the creation of the package, and I'm going to I'm going to just change the name. Let's say this is the from today. This is the eleven. 17 package am and and we're gonna we're gonna share everything the 3d model we don't have any sheets or views on this project so you will see sheets and, and views here as uh, so these sets is it refers to the to the sets that you prepare on Revit. so it's referring to to the under the collaborate tab those sets is referring to what you select here under Publish settings. We can select select set one, and we can we can also select a couple of a couple of views. We can save it. If we synchronize, we're synchronizing right now the project with these updates. So the file was synchronized and also I added uh, after that I added a, a new sheet and basically shared a 3D view sheet and an elevation and a floor plan. So we should be able to see those selected views on, on BIM360 design collaboration. So we are back on design collaboration and, and we are under the, the team architectural team and we want to we want to see to update to latest so we're gonna click here and now it's showing us that there is something to update so we're gonna hit update it's gonna start updating it takes a few minutes or seconds so after a minute was done with uh, updating the file we can we can now uh, create the package, or we can we can see the set, and we're gonna go ahead and create the package. We're gonna give it again. We're gonna, I'm gonna, just gonna use the the time right now, eleven twenty six, and uh, and we we can select here. So notice that if you select the set, it will select the model as well. But if you select the model. It won't select the sets, the set that you're sharing. So let's select every select everything, and we change the the name here, and and we can add a, a description to it. So we're gonna save, and and we're gonna share it. It's sharing right now, and it's telling me that so I created a, a real uh, a little bubble here. Which is telling me that I shared the package 01 team arc 1126 
on the 24th of April. Okay, so on the next video we're gonna see how how the furniture team is able to to pull this data and, and use it.